Hey everybody, welcome to today's episode of Staggy Fish. Uh, unfortunately, believe it or not, I'm quarantined again for like five days because somebody at work had the coronavirus and yeah. So now I have plenty of time to organize what I want to turn into basically like my own little fishing corner where I have all my gear organized. And uh, one of my favorite parts about it is this pegboard wall because I can hang up all my baits just like in a tackle store. So if I see something, I just hang it up and it organizes all my stuff. And I don't know, I think it's just gonna be pretty cool. But anyway, i kind of show you guys. Um, I'm gonna move this probably, oops, sorry, I'm getting used to this over there. And then uh, this table probably move a little bit. Not much, because I want to put this big piece of pegboard right here. So it'll kind of just take up that whole wall. And then, yeah, over here I'll have like shelves and all my fishing rods and stuff right here. Maybe more shelves. And then over there's my garage gym. Still a work in progress, as is everything in this house basically. But um, yeah, really need to sweep and get all the dust off this first. But I think this is gonna be a pretty fun little project and uh, I like organizing fish and tackle, so it kinda gives me something to do while I'm quarantined. I'm really not gonna go too in depth with this video, but uh, I hope you guys enjoy watching me kinda create my little fishing area back here. All right, I already ran into my first hurdle here. Of course, like I wanna put this board here, but it overlaps this one just a hair, so. I think I have to make the decision to either just overlap it or cut it. I think it'll look okay overlapped. I mean, of course it's a different color, so that doesn't really help things. But I think it'll be okay. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna try to overlap it. That's the plan, but whoop, as you guys can see, without falling on me. Sorry, I'm trying to use this gimbal for my camera. I don't really have it figured out yet, but um, I got it all cleaned up a little bit. Let's see if I can change the, the view mode. Like, how do I change this? Now it's just staring straight at the ceiling. Okay, let's try this again. So, I've got, oh, I still don't have it figured out. I suck with this thing. But, um, I've got, I moved that bench over here, which worked out pretty nice a little bit less room to walk behind my truck but you can still squeeze through there I think I'm gonna put the shelves over here and my fishing rods kind of in this area I uh, just kind of waving my hands around like I know what my plan is but if I can get this thing to go down all this all these lures and baits they're all gonna be hung up all of them I guess the next step is trying to drill that thing up there on the board, so uh, let's get to that. Well, all right, guys, I got it up. Goes all the way down there to the floor. And uh, yeah, it kind of overlaps a little bit. Of course, they're all three different colors, but you know, I'm just kind of working with what I have and stuff that is free, so that really helps. Um, I found all those screws on the ground. So I guess now, guys, I'm just kind of kind of anxious to start putting baits up. So uh, that's kind of what I'm gonna do next. All right, so basically how I'm going to be hanging everything up is with these little hooks. Um, you can see I already got some hung up. I'm going to definitely move where these are just so I get everything looking uniform. But they're just real, real easy to install. Just like at a, you know, pretty much any, any store where you'd be buying fishing baits. This is probably going to be like the longest process of just figuring out how I actually want stuff uh, organized. So I'll probably catch up with you guys once I have a semblance of my plan going on.
All right, guys, gotten uh, pretty much as far as I can get. I've run out of pegs, but um, I think it's looking pretty good. As you can see, I know, you're probably being like, why do you have all these saltwater baits hung up? And really, just because I like to look at them, and I know I really can't use them since I'm about 2,000 miles away from the Gulf of Mexico, but they look good on the wall, and plus, wherever I travel to next, I will definitely be using those. But moving on, I mean, pretty much my wall is kind of dominated by a bunch of Guggen baits right now. Um, I've really been enjoying their stuff. A lot of it I just kind of bought, honestly, just to try it out. But, um, you know, got a bunch of Lunker Logs, some Mondo Worms, and then my favorite, which is that Kraken Craw, the, the Bama Bug. I got some smaller ones. Uh, some different colors also, but uh, over here you know, we've got the we've got the Grande Bass and some some Gary Yamamoto worms. Uh, got some Zoom up there. Yeah, I guess I mean there's there's really not too much to it. I do have quite a few. Oh geez, can't don't know how to work this thing. Tons of baits still that I can hang up, but for now. Uh, this is pretty much it. So now that I've gotten pretty much as far as I can get with uh, putting all the baits on the wall, uh, I'm gonna set up my my rod rack here. See if I can fit all my rods, kind of make it look good. Alright guys, I just finished up putting all my rods away. Sorry if it's a little shaky now. I uh, took it off my gimbal, I'm trying to figure that thing out still. But pretty much got all my bait casters on this side. And then on this side, got a whole bunch of my spinning reels. I still need to get like my offshore rods and stuff like that. But so far, I'm pretty happy with the way it turned out. Like I said, I still have a bunch of baits I need to put up. I have to order more pegs. I'll probably end up ordering like two more boxes. Um, I mean, one box got me pretty far, but I have a whole bunch of stuff. And I'm just going to keep getting more stuff, so I might as well have some extra. And also, I have to uh, set up my shelf so I can hold like a bunch of my other fishing stuff, all the boxes, tackle trays I have. But that pretty much does it, guys. Uh, sorry for the lack of actual fishing videos, but I hope you guys enjoy this kind of stuff. Uh, it's, I enjoy organizing fishing tackle. I don't know about you guys. But if you guys enjoyed the video, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, and, you know, hit the notification bell so it actually tells you when I post a video. But anyway, this will probably be part one of, uh, I don't know how many part series of, you know, kind of creating this into my little fishing man cave back here. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>